all right guys welcome back to the channel and today we have a very special unboxing it is a mask that i have waited for for quite some time at least to become available um, because these pieces are not made anymore it is a slipknot mask and i'll get into it in a second but first i'd like to say thank you to jared smalley jared smalley tattoos over on facebook and instagram they sold me this piece at a bargain of a price pretty much and uh no one scooped this up so i was just like okay i need to get on this so again thank you to jared smalley for selling me this piece it's one of my favorite pieces ever in slipknot history so without further ado just kind of want to make this a short and sweet video and also it's kind of late so let's just get right into it so again this is a piece that i have awaited for quite some time and not saying that like it took long to ship or that like he messed up or anything i'm just more so saying that since these are not made anymore they're hard to find at such a good price that i got it for so let's hop right on into it all righty so this is what it looks like so far don't think there's anything else in the bag this is a second hand piece and it is one of the better sculpts. You can see it poking out right there. Get this bag a tug. And boom. So as you can see, this is a DBS Iowa Craig. If you don't know who DBS is, he's a retired Slipknot mask creator. He still makes masks, so if you want to check out his Instagram, um, it's just Drop Bear Studio Masks. Uh, but he used to make these and sell these. He had a website for them, ended up getting taken down, ended up being this huge drama. But now I finally have one of the best and most accurate Craig sculpts out in the hobby. I know United, United, or no, Killer Studios or United Industry Masks, whichever one. I, sorry if I forget, but they also have an Instagram. Daniel Cushion over in the House of Masks makes an Iowa Craig skull. It's good, but I still feel like this one is just slightly better. So as you can see, the nails aren't in it due to shipping. So this is just the naked mask. And inside the head, let me unzip it actually, that'd be a smart idea. Okay, we'll just lay this down right here. Inside the head, Oh goody, I'm getting my self-titled Craig flashback. We have all these freaking nails that go inside the head just in a big old bag and a bunch of bubble wrap. So, without further ado, again, just want to make this a nice short and sweet video and a thanks to Jared Smiley for selling me such a nice piece like this. I'm super excited and over the moon to add this to my collection. I have a self-titled Craig up there. It's completely finished, early self-titled. I probably need to drill holes in the visor, but I am not doing that. <laughs> so I'm gonna start putting the nails in and then just show you guys the whole mask it worn if I can fit in it and yep that'll be it so thank you for watching and stay tuned for the nice worn look that it has all right guys I'm just doing a little bit of a voiceover uh just to kind of explain what's going on because I couldn't exactly talk in the mask <laughs> as you can tell because I could barely fit my head in it um I couldn't zip the mask down and I had this hood on because if I could they would get caught in my hair uh, and I'm headbanging right here and I'm just letting you guys know that I it was a miracle I actually put this and got this fitted on my head like that so I kind of left it unzipped and I also just wanted to explain that I am missing a nail on the top of the head I found it it was in the box but I literally was just not paying attention because it was late at night so Enjoy the uh, rest of the content on the channel, and thanks for watching.